Blue Period and Tick Tick Boom did something incredible for me. These two pieces of entertainment might not seem like they have a lot in common at a glance. One's about a high school student struggling with his oil paintings, and the other is a biopic about a musical theater genius. The common thread is art, and that need, that drive that individuals have to create something, anything, just to be able to have a creation. Both main characters share this drive, and it's a drive I share as well. Definitely sounds pretentious, I know. If you take a look at my YouTube channel, you'll see only two of my projects. Not the countless scrapped works that no one will ever see but me. That's one of my biggest fears. Scrapping everything from now until I die and not creating anything ever again. I want to do so much more with my life. Even if these creations of mine are total garbage, they're still going to be mine, and they're something that I can be proud of. It's just finding the will and the passion to create. It's been something I've struggled with since I started making videos back in early 2019. I started my first project in March 2019, and it came out in January 2020. The next project that I actually finished was started in June 2020 and finished February 2021. Now it's December 2021, and even after 10 months, I have almost no fraction of any video completed. I want more. I know I can do more. I've said those words multiple times, but I could just never seem to open that Word document and start writing. Things always took precedent before creating, and as each day passes, it gets easier and easier to not open that Word doc. There have been days, even some weeks, when the thought of creating hasn't even crossed my mind. Like I said before, Blue Period and Tick Tick Boom did something for me. They both shocked me out of the slump I had put myself into this year. Since these stories are both about the journey of creating, I had no choice but to think about my own journey, and I couldn't be more thankful that I watched this anime and film. Blue Period is about Yatora Yaguchi, a delinquent high school student who's still at the top of his class. He has great grades, a dependable group of friends, and he considers every one of his days fun. But that fun has a certain hollowness to it. Yatora doesn't feel complete. Through some inspiration from a member of his school's art club, he finds himself inspired to create his own art. But with entrance exams into art school fast approaching, he must quickly improve his own skills and find his own voice before it's too late to pursue his newfound passion. Tick Tick Boom is about Jonathan Larson, a 29, almost 30-year-old musical theater writer who waits tables to pay the bills. But as he comes closer and closer to being 30 years old without creating anything substantive, he is afraid that he'll become a waiter who writes musical theater in his free time. As his 30th birthday closes in, he has one shot to get his original rock musical off the ground before he might lose any and all chances to make a name for himself. That ticking in his head is ringing, and he can't hear anything else, ticking down until everything explodes. Tick. 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 Time. 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 They're running out of time. I'm running out of time. To do something great. This truly woke me up. Lit the fire under me. I need to make the most of the time I have. To use that time and make things that I'm proud of. Not wasting away behind Netflix or a PlayStation. I can do this. I've done it before. And I will not truly express myself only twice in my life and never again. I can create. And thanks to Blue Period and Tick Tick Boom, I will again. Tick. Tick. Tick.